Please bear in mind that the no-fly zone that was the question was raised and is increasingly, go I suspect, going to become more and more important uh, as as the as the war escalates or as the special military operation, if we really must, as the war escalates. Um, please remember that this is not just a, a statement of something that we we do. Okay, this is a, this is an activity with ramifications. What this means is effectively um, suppressing adversary ground uh, uh, ground and air defence. And that will have to be both in Ukraine, uh, possibly, but also within Russia. That means strikes on, on, on Russia. Just so that we're explicit about what this means, that means that we will almost certainly end up in an exchange of fire with, 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 with the Russians. I mean, let, let's just be clear about what that means. Not just, why don't we implement it? Why don't we do this? Why don't we do that? As though it's, somewhat, as though it's something that can just be done without consequence. So that, if that happens, I hope that our political leaders and our strategic leaders have worked out the second and third stages of that, because that that evolves the conflict from a from a local war to at least a regional war in which we will be involved. So, I mean, to my mind, considerable considerable uh, strategic thought needs to go into that.